Hiya folks, I'm Grim, and welcome to Grim Grooves, a channel where I react to and review music of all kinds. Today we'll be checking out the animated short The Embers of Glamoth from Konkai Star Rail. Uh, you guys suggested this, so I'm going to check it out, and I'm looking forward to it, because every single animation I've seen from any MiHoYo game so far is absolutely stunning, even the earlier ones. So, and I believe this is fairly new. So I'm, I'm excited to find out more. And also, I've only seen so much from Honkai Star Rail in terms of animations. So I'm really curious to see, like, to, like, learn more about the world and the universe and all that type of stuff. Because it's all really cool. <laughs> but if you've got anything else you'd like me to check out, throw it down in the comments. And while you're down there, make sure you hit the like button and subscribe. It helps the channel so much, and I appreciate every single person who supports me there. And I've also got a Patreon you can check out. And I'd like to thank everyone who supports me over there. So thank you again. <laughs> but without further ado... Let's check out the Embers of Glamoth. Command! Firefly Squad 4 reinforced at the Swarm Run! Firefly Squad 2 reinforced at the Rift Valley! Forward! Forward! Requesting reinforcements! I repeat, requesting reinforcements! This is not at all what I was expecting this video to be. Not that I had any really any idea other than just the things I've seen from Star Rail, but yeah, this is so intense and so crazy. Like person in Maxu just fighting a bunch of like this is like the middle of a war zone. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> Suits are crazy. Look out, Pete. The target's straight ahead. Keep pushing forward. Damn it. This is so epic and the music is equally as epic building up like just huge booming like this type of thing you'd see in like a really high action like uh, action movie i guess like just one of those popcorn movies where it's like there doesn't really have to be a lot of story it's just a lot of really high action set pieces and things like that like a michael bay movie but that's what this music sounds like at this point but we're only still building and um, i know that the story for this game is significantly better than those would be but still this is really cool Firefly? I'm not exactly sure. Like, because I know in the trailer I just watched the other day, Firefly was in, like, a suit like this. But, again, I have no idea. Like, this is probably the first time I've actually seen, kind of, outfits like this and a war like this. And, again, I have no idea who they're fighting against or anything like that. But it's all very intriguing and interesting. Like, this is so cool. Like, such high-quality animations. Her Majesty! also wanted to mention like the strings there were getting very mournful like it was it went from being incredibly intense music to like being very mournful and uh contemplative like emotional strings there for a second leading up to this moment and now you can see why because the one person got impaled <laughs> but yeah this is crazy and now the music is getting a lot more intense again 
So I'm guessing that, I don't know, something crazy is about to happen. Her, her Majesty! was intense. <laughs> the music cuts away. Oh, damn. Are they clones or something? They all look like they have the same face. That's interesting. I, I could be wrong. Maybe I'm just mistaken there. Am I dead? It's a fair question. Who died? Looks like everyone. Damn. This is like a scene from Attack on Titan or something. Like. <laughs> Wow. Very dark. For to fight such is the honor of Clemot's life. That's such an interesting idea, just like uh futuristic sci-fi army that's made up of mech soldiers like obviously i mean you guys probably know because you've played the game and stuff like that you know more of the story and this is probably commonplace for you but just for me the idea of that like a uh, kind of middle uh, like medieval like military can, like group kind of thing like the type of thing you'd see like king arthur's court kind of thing except in modern day or futuristic society but they all have mech suits like that's just a really interesting story idea <laughs> Majesty. She's the last one left. Maybe. Do we die? So they are clones. Why do we live? to this point like i know there's some emotional moments but i don't really know the characters or anything around them and stuff like that so that didn't really get me when the music started to swell that's when the emotions hit me more like i'm actually going to go back 10 seconds actually 15 seconds because try and get a little bit more of this melody it's such a good melody and the horns coming in everything like that like it's so emotional like wow this is crazy and whisper it to me weird the second this explosion went off the my computer is like what wigged out for a second <laughs> but anyways let's get back to it blew up the planet 
Damn. Ooh. Dancing among the stars. Wow. So is that like Firefly's origin story? Like that was so intense and so awesome. Like I had no idea what to expect going into this, like I said, but like that was so stunning. And like I had no idea that Star or Hong Kong Star Rail had any kind of crazy battles like that in their history or whether it, or not there's actually wars going on as you play through the game or something like that. But it's so awesome to see like and again, the enemies they were fighting against, these like bug creatures and stuff like that, again, have no idea about any of the enemies or monsters in the game kind of thing. So that's super interesting. Like it seems like such an interesting world. And that music, especially near the end with the piano melody and like the horns coming in there and everything, like that was such a beautiful swell of emotion to, with those mu that music. It just sounded so amazing. Especially like, again, the last little bit with the piano melodies going on there. Like it was so incredible. Like this was fantastic. And just, I don't know, Firefly seems like such an awesome character. I'm like, I have so many questions as well, but again, I'll get to those when I play the game as well. So it's fine. Like, I, and I can't wait. It's going to be so fun to actually play Honkai Star Rail and again, probably Honkai Impact 3rd as well, because that also looks incredible. Like, I know it's, there's uh, some issues with how old it is, and like, whatever, but I don't care. <laughs> I care about the story and the music and stuff like that, so I'm still excited. But anyways... If you liked the video, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe. And until next time, later days, folks.